Now I am gonna go over just fucking clutch situations. And I, I've done this before, but in case you're new in here, if you have a smoke and it's a 1v1, you and like you have a lot of time on the bomb, you should be able to win these like 80% of the time. It's so easy, guys. Okay, let's say let's say the bomb is planted right here. Okay. And you've checked everything. Okay, he's not he's not fucking dark. He's not new box, like you've checked everything. So the bomb's planted right here. You're coming from CT. You go through construction. You you know you're checking everything. He's not there. He's not there. You know with your gun out, obviously. He's nowhere to be found. Okay, you check here, here. He's he's nowhere to be found. And you have a strong feeling he's on banana. All you have to fucking do if you have a smoke, you just do this. Tap the bomb, and then change your angle. You could even like go this far. You could, you could even just hide right here. So tap the bomb, like smoke it. Tap the bomb and just hide right here. He's gonna come out freaking out spraying. Let him let him shoot you a couple times and then you come on you kill the guy. There you fucking go. Easy win. It's so easy. All you have to do so the bomb's planted right here. Throw a smoke, tap the bomb, and then change your angle. Just like walk over here. He'll come out, just hide. You don't even have to fucking be peeking the guy. Let him spray at the smoke a couple times. Then you come out, you kill him. Okay, you have no idea how easy it is to win situations if you're in a smoke. Another thing you could do. Here, let's say you don't have that much time, okay? The bomb is planted, same spot. You don't have that much time. He's not peeking your new box. He's not there. What you could do is just throw a smoke. Just throw a smoke there on the bomb and just wait here. And then you could... You'll know. The guy will peek from emo if he's there. Like, it's a way to eliminate lots of spots. You don't even have to tap the bomb because a lot of times when you put a smoke on the bomb, people think you're ninja defusing. So all you have to do is just, even if you're not on the bomb, you just throw a smoke on it, and you just hide. If this guy's emo, he'll come out spraying, and then look, easy fucking kill for this guy. He won't even pay attention. Hey, can not everyone is as cool as you under pressure, especially when the bomb is booping? <laughs> but yeah, so that's the, if you have a smoke, that's the number one tip I could give you. Just throw it on the bomb, change your position. A lot of people try ninja defusing. So if, you, if I have a smoke here, instead of instead of waiting right here, just go a little farther out. Make yourself harder to spot. Okay? So yeah, I see some people do the smoke, but they still do it wrong because they just like sit right here next to the smoke. The problem is when you do that, yeah, you'll, you'll probably still get the jump on him. But let's say I'm coming out. He's already aiming in that area. But, you know, let's say this is smoked. And this guy comes here. He's going to be like gonna do this he's gonna be like what the fuck i'm not dying he's gonna be looking here and then although you're right here and then easy kill on him because he's not gonna be expecting you to be behind the fucking fountain okay another you know same situation let's say bomb planted right